This week on The Wire, outlook brighter than expected, home builder heating up and homeowners return to repayments. G'day guys, my name's Tim Guest and welcome to The Wire, the week in real estate where you can get all the top stories happening this week in finance, real estate, investment and more. Now please like, comment and share this video and if it's your first time tuning in, don't forget to follow or subscribe wherever you're seeing this. So our top story for this week, outlook brighter than expected. So, Australia's economy is in a stronger position than predicted despite the COVID-19 pandemic, and that says a report by Deloitte Access Economics. The report's lead author, Chris Richardson, says the outcomes are healthier and happier than the forecast from the Federal Treasury and the Reserve Bank, and it's largely because consumers have spent much more than expected. He says the central bit of the economy and the spot where the fear may have showed up the most has actually done surprisingly well. See, retail sales in May increased 5.8% on the figures from May last year. The Reserve Bank predicted consumer spending to drop by 15% between March and June 2020 quarters, but May's strong figures suggest that this uh, is unlikely to eventuate. Infrastructure will also be critical to the rebuilding process with state and federal governments already expediting many projects to help stimulate the economy. With another key to the econo economic recovery would be avoiding stopping the job seeker, job keeper and other stimulus measures at the same time. And now guys for our next story, home builder scheme heating up. So inquiries from land from prospective homeowners have tripled since April and that's following the announcement of the federal government's home builder scheme. And that's according to data from realestate.com.au. Developers were flooded with inquiries in June after the announcement of the $25,000 grants for new builds with inquiries about land up by 63%. REA Director of Economic Research Cameron Kusher says the home builder package has provided, a, uh, sorry, has proved attractive to first home buyers and is likely to inspire many to bring forward their plans to buy. Kusher says surprisingly there was a pickup in May before the scheme was announced, which suggests people were comfortable with the idea of building a home and feeling confident. The cherry on top was home builder, and since then we've seen inquiry levels go from strength to strength. The rise in inquiry was particularly prominent in the more affordable markets. Tasmanian and West Australian projects drew the most attention, up 204% and 179% respectively, while South Australia up 99% and Queensland 97% were also popular. And now guys, for our final story of the week, homeowners return to repayments. So many homeowners who had accessed mortgage holiday programs when COVID-19 struck have returned to making full repayments on their home loans. But for those still struggling, the major banks have announced a four month extension of payment deferrals. Major banks say that the number of customers asking to defer their mortgage repayments fell in June as economic conditions improved. Australian Banking Association Chief Executive Anna Bly says encouragingly, banks are seeing that many deferred customers are choosing to resume making loan repayments. This is important. Returning to paying down your loan as soon as you can is better in the long run for you, your business, and the economy. Westpac's acting chief uh, uh, executive of consumer banking, Richard Burnton, said many of the bank's 120,000 customers who had applied for a payment freeze have asked to resume their loan commitments before the end of the grace period. CBA says 20% of customers who had requested deferrals are now making some payments. According to NAB, 10 to 15% of its customers who claimed hardship have reversed decisions to re defer repayments. Well guys, they're the top stories for the week. Now please don't forget to like, comment and share this video and follow or subscribe wherever you're seeing this. Also, have a great week and remember, there's only one thing in life that makes a difference and that's action. Thanks a lot guys, bye for now.